Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tag. In this quick video I'll show you guys how you can add another email account on your Outlook application. I have done another video how to do that on classic Outlook application and for that you find the link on the description below. But in this video I'll show how to do that on your new Outlook application. So basically Microsoft has released lately a new Outlook design and for that the settings and some functions are different from the standard uh, Outlook classic that we had before. On the new Outlook, the steps are pretty much straightforward. What we do, normally you should have on the left, here at the end, the option to add account. But just clicking over add account, you'll have the possibility to add another email on your Outlook application. So we click there, and over here you have to specify the email address that you want to add here. The other way how to do that, or how to come on this page, is by going over settings. The settings for the new Outlook are here at the top. You see here this gear, you click over there. So over here then you go over accounts and directly over email accounts you have this option here, add account. So we click over add account and then you'll be redirected to the page where you can add the other email address that you want to have on your Outlook application. Something that I want to add, if you don't see this add account possibility, what you have to do is try to update your Outlook application. And then if again, you don't see it, there are high chances that your administrator have blocked it. If you are using an office account, which is from your work or from your school, for example. But normally by default they don't block it, so they let you create or add other accounts on your Outlook application. So we click over add and account. here you'll have all the email accounts that you want to add. You can add a Yahoo email account, a Gmail or an Outlook, it doesn't matter. Just write here the email address. I'm going to go ahead and add another Outlook email. Once you are done, you just click over continue. And then it will ask you to log in with the password, etc., etc. But in my case, I have already logged in, so my computer has already saved this password. So once you are done, your emails are now synced. We click over done, and then you are able to start using the new Outlook email that you have just added over here. So here it is. It is showing here on the left the other email so that's all that i wanted to share with you guys today i hope you like this video and please consider subscribing to our channel wish to you all the best thank you